Welcome to Virox technical video for facades with hidden mechanical fastening. Use panels with 12 millimeters for standard application or 16 millimeters for greater resistance to impact and wind loads. The panels should have a maximum size of 1,500 by 1,250 millimeters. Ensure the wall surface is clean, dry, and free from debris. Install aluminum support brackets to hold the vertical profiles Add insulation material to the support wall using wide head plastic anchors and attach vertical aluminum profiles to the support brackets. Use fixed connections at the top for stability and adjustable connections below to allow for thermal expansion. Fix C-shaped aluminum rails horizontally across the vertical profiles at maximum intervals of 600 millimeters. Ensure the rails are precisely aligned and secure them with two self-drilling screws per intersection point. Use a drill with a depth stop to prepare holes for the hidden anchors on the back of each panel. Using the appropriate drill attachment, install undercut anchors in the drilled holes. Fix hangers onto the back of each panel at the anchor points. Use standard, fixed, or adjustable hangers as per the instructions, which should include one adjustable hanger on each top corner and one fixed hanger on the top center point. Secure the rest of the anchor points using standard hangers. Adjust the screws on the top hangers to align the panel and use the fixed screw to prevent the panel from sliding. Slide the panels onto the horizontal rails, starting from the bottom and working upwards. Ensure a five to eight millimeter gap between adjacent panels to accommodate expansion and maintain a ventilation gap with a minimum of 20 millimeters between the panels and the wall to allow for air circulation. At the bottom of the facade, maintain a gap with a minimum of 50 millimeters and install a rodent-proof grill to prevent pest entry. Finally, add corner profiles, edge trims, or angle profiles as needed for a clean finish. And that's it. For more information, download our technical files.